Welcome to Rig It Yourself 101. Uh, today, I'm going to show you how to charge an iPod using your USB iPod cables and things you can find at home. Now these are the items you're going to need. An iPod USB cable, your iPod, box cutters, a tangerine, a banana, an apple, two 16 penny nails, and tie wires. Two of them. Now the first thing we're going to do is strip out the ends of the tie wires using the box cutters. Now when you strip the tie wire, one end of the tie wire should be an inch and a half long, the other end should be a half inch long. And do both of them this way. Now the next step is to take the longer end of the wire, the one that you stripped out an inch and a half, and wrap it around the head of the nail four times. One, two, three, four. Now, now that both of them are done, we're going to go to the apple. Now you're going to insert the nail a half inch into the apple, just like this. Now we're going to use the tangerine and insert the nail a half inch inside the tangerine. Now that you've completed this, we're ready to insert the other end into the banana. Now, when inserting the wires into the banana, you want to make sure that both wires are approximately one inch apart from each other. Like that. Now, you want to let it sit like this for at least 15 minutes to allow enough time for the acidic energy to transfer. And we found that the longer you let it sit like this, the better the charge will be to charge your iPod. Now, I let this sit for 30 minutes to show you that it has a good charge. The next part is simple. Just take your USB cable and insert it directly between both wires. Now watch it charge. Let's see if we have charge. Amazing. That is amazing. And there you have it. Acidic electro power. It's just that easy. And thanks for watching. Rig it yourself 101. Stay tuned.